Hey, this is Will. So in this video, I am going to try and explain some of the main things that you need to know about Tailwind and how exactly does this tool differ from all of the other tools. I think this is going to be very, very interesting. I absolutely love Tailwind and there's so much value you can get out of this tool. So definitely watch the whole video to really understand it. Also, I do have special discounts and bonuses. So there are links down below in the description. Also, every single week I give out one of my courses completely for free. So just subscribe to my YouTube channel and press thumbs up on this video to enter the competition. And also I do have a main channel where I talk all about online business, digital marketing, all that kind of good stuff. So definitely check that out as well. I will leave a link down below. Also, now let's jump straight into the video. All right, so the first thing why I really love Tailwind is the board list so by the way don't ignore this i just was too lazy to blur things out so that's why i'm just covering using this to cover some of my board lists but what this allows you to do is as you have different boards on your pinterest what you can do is you can just create a list so let's say i'm yoga all boards so you can let's say if you have a yoga account and you have different boards for let's say beginners yoga yoga for um, advanced people yoga for uh, depression whatever it is you can take all of those boards and you can put them into one list and then when you're scheduling out your pins in the next step you can just use a board list so automatically you don't need to be scheduling out all of those pins to one board and then scheduling them out to the next board and the third and so on you can make a list you can even do let's say five different boards and at once you apply all of those boards to those pins so that just if <laughs> that just saves off so 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 much time so for you to understand just a little bit better when you go to the actual scheduling as you can see first of all you have your drafts here so i just uploaded a few pictures in the drafts and the cool thing also what i love about this is that you can uh, basically upload multiple images at once and if you know pinterest you are if you don't know yet you should be creating more than one image per every blog post or whatever exactly you're sending the traffic to uh, so you can upload multiple images at once in bulk, which again saves up a lot of time. And as you can see here, I have a board list where I have three different uh, boards. So I just need to put that in here. And by the way, this is very cool as well that if let's say I am, maybe I upload, let's say 20 pins at once, I can just put in uh, the board list here. And then all of these boards are automatically applied to all of the pins that I have. And in this case, they are also three different boards for every single image so this just saves up so much time for me rather than doing this one by one if i would be doing this one board okay i apply a board here then assign board here assign board here and then i need to do that all that same thing with all of the other board uh, with the same images Whereas with this, I just press one button and it's all done for me. All of the images have boards and they have multiple boards all at once. And that is it, which is absolutely amazing. And also the cool thing, what I like as well, I'm not going to go into full thing, but if you put in the URL right here, then it automatically also extracts the title. So that again is just a little bit of a time saver once again. And another thing that is very cool about scheduling or actually not even about scheduling, but um, what you can do to make this whole process easier for you. They actually allow you to add collaborators to your Tailwind account. So if you have virtual assistant and you should get a virtual assistant to do this for you, because this is a very simple task that anyone can really do once you give them a little tutorial. So you can actually add a couple of different collaborators if you want. And when they schedule out, so as you can see, we're at drafts now, once they uh, do all the scheduling, you have this section here as well, awaiting approval. So that is very cool as well, that it doesn't go straight to your schedule because let's face it, people sometimes make mistakes. So if you want to actually check on what your virtual assistant has done and if they done everything correctly, you can actually go to the waiting approval and then you just press one button and then all of those pins go from uh, waiting approval to the scheduled pins. So that is 
a feature that is just so 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 useful when you're actually have other people managing all the work for you so another feature that is very very useful with tailwind and this is one of the main selling points for me at least i would say is smart loops so what smart loops means is basically when you put a pin on pinterest after a certain amount of time you can put it into your smart loops and after a certain amount of time tailwind is going to automatically recreate that pin one more time so for example it might three or four months i think the minimum now is four months so after four months pass they can recreate that pin once again so you don't need to do anything you don't need to do any work whatsoever and then you get new content created on your or your pinterest once again so this is a very 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 powerful tool so as you can see and you can create different smart loops as well so you can basically um if you want let's say to have certain pins go on certain um different bars and on certain different periods of time and all of that so you do have a lot of different customization and you can choose what kind of pins you add as well and as you can see basically you have different plans so you can choose um how the different plan of how many smart loops you want to have in total but it's very very customizable and all of that so really a lot of props for tailwind for having this feature the next thing that i love about tailwind and that i think is something that you need to know about is the actual pinning schedule so the cool thing why i like this because obviously you always will have your schedules what i like about it is that it makes it very very simple to customize so as you can see right here you have your recreate schedule so if i just press on this button i can choose how many pins i want to have scheduled out per day so let's say for example if you are just starting out pinning or uh, there, there's some period when you don't have that many pins you might not want to be scheduling uh, scheduling out a ton of pins at once because then Pinterest might see that as a spam. So it's very easy from here. I can just type in, let's say I want 10 pins, uh, sorry, if I want 10 pins per day and then it, everything is going to be changed in my schedule and every single day there are going to be 10 pins coming out or I can increase or decrease and instantly change my whole schedule, not needing to do um, any manual work whatsoever. So I think that is very, very powerful uh, feature to have as well. All right, so the next thing that again is something that only Tailwind has and is so so powerful and I'm not going to go into the actual tab because I don't want to show all of my information but they have this section called tribes so basically you can join a few different tribes and you can pin your own pins to the tribes and then you need to repin other people's pins so basically you need to keep the same ratio of pinning and repinning and when you share your pins there as well other people are going to repin them so you're going to get some extra tra traction basically from pinning these into these group bars so that can be a very very powerful tool to use as well to get more traffic from pinterest aside from that you also have a lot of insights and again i'm not going through all of this stuff i'm just going through the main things that you need to know but you do have some really cool stats so once again i don't want to open this for you to see all of my stats but you have all of your boards insights you have your pin insights website top performing pins and all of that so this does allow pinterest does have analytics by themselves but these are a lot more detailed analytics and it does allow you to really see what exactly is happening with your pinterest and how you can improve things and maybe what you can take advantage of and all of those kind of things so it is if you are all about analytics this is a very very useful thing all right so let's go to the pricing and the pricing is a little bit interesting so let me take a minute to actually explain how this works to you so first of all you do have a free trial and after that you need to pay $15 a month to have the plus plan for Pinterest specifically. By the way, they also do Instagram, but I'm only talking about Pinterest because um, this tool is really, I would say, mainly for Pinterest. So it's $15 a month and that is for one account. So you can have a few different accounts on one, a few different Pinterest accounts on one Tailwind account but you will need to pay separately for all of the different accounts which is a little bit annoying but 
Still, $15 for that when you think about it. Again, if you look at, let me see, I have thousand, more than a thousand pins scheduled out and the amount of time that I save up, yes, I could basically have my virtual assistant to go on Pinterest and do all of the scheduling for me manually and I am paying very little for these kind of tasks because they are very simple. But when you look at all of the board lists that I mentioned, when you look at being able to switch around your schedule and all of that, and one thing I didn't mention as well, what you can do here, as you can see, you can shuffle the queue. So at some point when let's say you're adding new pins, if you don't want them to be the very, very much at the back, you can just press this button and it can shuffle all the pins around. So all of these features really make it worth for me to be paying that fee every single month because I do save up money to use the scheduling instead of just having my virtual assistant to spend more time for them uh, to do everything manually. If they would just do everything manually, definitely would cost me more than extra $15 a month. And as you can see, so what you get on the plus plan, as I said, you get one profile, then you get 400 posts a month and you get 250 free smart loops and you get five Tailwind tribes. So basically you can join up to five different tribes. And if you choose the annual plan, then as you can see, it only costs $10 per month, which is really for what you get it is so, so, so cheap. And the cool thing is also then you get unlimited scheduling so you can have as many pins as you want and the same amount of smart loops and tribes. So if you want to actually have more tribes, then they have another pricing for that, which they call power ups. And that's why I said that the pricing is a little bit complex because they actually divide all of those different things. So it kind of depends. I mean, if you don't want certain things that that is actually good. Uh, but as you can see, uh, so the beginning plan, the tribes pro, costs $7.50 a month and that allows you to join 10 different tribes and you have 80 tribe submissions so basically that those submissions mean uh, repins and then the max plan is $15 unlimited tribes but again they limit the amount of repins you can do so you can do 200 per month and tribes unlimited so everything unlimited for 45 dollars and again they have the annual plan where you get a discount and what they also have if you notice this on the side they actually have basically a bundle of everything included together so as you can see here you are paying 39 well basically you're paying 40 dollars a month and you do need to pay annually so you can just get this offer monthly but with this plan you have you get the tailwind plus and then you get unlimited smart loops and unlimited tribes and submissions so basically you get maximum of everything that there is and you are only paying $40 a month so this is actually a really really good plan and let me just show you if you want by the way to, to get extra smart loops the pricing is basically the same $750, uh, $15, $45 and you get 500 smart loops so you start with $250 for free then you get 500, you get a thousand and you get um, unlimited for $45. Again, you get discounts if you choose annual plan. And then if you want to, again, go with this offer, you can get everything for all three, as they say, included for $40 a month, which is a very, very good plan. So I hope you found this video useful. I absolutely love Tailwind. I've gotten so many good results. And this is the, one of those tools that I just recommend to everyone. So as I said, I do have some special discounts and bonuses, a link down below in the description. Also check out my other channel that is all about online business and digital marketing and all that good stuff. If you found this video useful, make sure to press thumbs up, subscribe to my YouTube channel so you see more reviews of useful tools that might help out your business. Stay awesome and I'll see you soon.